so so I've got um I've got two wires here that are connected to to this to this green box. And what this green box does is that it places a a small voltage across these two wires, right? Um, and because the plant has its own voltage that it changes just to just to act, and it, that's always changing as it's sort of living, it affects the voltage that this goes across. Just in the same way that um, if if you uh, hang hang a sheet out, for example, on, on the washing line, mm -hmm. the wind will interfere with it and it will go back, will blow a little bit. Yeah. I'm placing a voltage across this, right, and then so. the plant interferes with my voltage and sort of moves it a little, moves that, moves that volt, which then gets picked up in here. Okay, so but first of all, I'm going to try and connect this very low down where the roots are to begin with and then I'm going to see if I can get anything from here. These are succulent leaves so we found that the succulent leaves are uh, um, it's, it's, hard, it's hard to get information from. Uh -huh. Right, so where am I? <coughs> on the green box. So let's just have a look and see what we've got. Oh my word. That's interesting. So 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 what we're listening to at the moment is is just the sound that's coming from here. So what, what, what we're hearing at the moment is just the changes of voltage that are coming out. Right. So bearing in mind that this is just putting um, a straight voltage across, what we should be hearing if the plant wasn't connected would be just a series of taps which were exactly the same volume. Uh -huh. But we're not hearing that. No. We're hearing loud ones and soft ones. And quite a lot of difference between the loud ones and soft ones. So we know that it's alive. And it's working hard. So if you listen, some are really quiet and high, and others are quite loud and low. Yeah? And occasionally, occasionally there's, there's little gaps as well. You're here. Maybe not now. I've said that. Is that because it's uh, it just got a bit windier? Yeah, there's a breeze just going through, isn't there? Yeah. So, so, so we've got that information. Um, so what we can do now is that we can um, uh, make that changes of voltage control something. So if we make it control an oscillator, then like a sine wave, then then we'll, we'll hear the changes in the sine wave. But that, that hopefully will allow us to, let's, let's just see what we can hear. So I'm going to change to the oscillator and just see whether we can see what we can hear. the same we've just got rid of the, the it's the same sort of thing isn't yeah. it where you can hear this low notes and this high notes yeah. in there so what we'll do now is that we'll just move to um, uh, something that allows us just to hear the notes a little bit more so let's just try this So we should better hear the notes a wee bit more now. So. Yeah. 
so this is listening to the plant sort of every what, half a second or something like that. Every, every note is when it's listening to the plant and taking a measurement. But we can slow that down or speed that up so we can have less information. And sometimes by slowing something down or speeding it up, you can you can understand it a bit better. For example, you can now hear a tune, or you can hear the tune better when it's slower, but you can hear the sort of rhythm when it's faster. If you know what I mean. Yeah. But, Change the envelope a little bit. different wasn't it yeah so let's just see what happens now if we give this uh if we so instead of we giving it an oscillator let's just give it a sort of a piano-ish sound just just to see what happens roughly it should be roughly the same so we're not not getting any anywhere exciting at the moment Pauses, you know, it sort of does something and then it stops for a while, doesn't it? And then it's thinking about it. Yeah. 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 What do I do next? Yeah. Let's just um, give it a bit more space to think. Take 
a while. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's hard to hear, isn't it? It's yeah. hard to hear with that one. Let's let's try um it's we found these succulent plants to be quite quite difficult to work yeah. with. But we could try it with a more sensitive machine or we'll try and we'll just try a different we'll just try a different thing. So that's that. And where's the other one? There's one in the soil. Can you say. grab it? Yeah. So same thing as before, one on the leaf. In fact, I'll put it here just to... And one on the... one near the root. And we'll just see. So this is a sort of a pumpkin -y thing, which... It takes a while for it to... Give the leaf a tickle. Interesting. Interesting. <laughs> let's have another go. Let's have a, let's try another plant. Yeah. 
Yeah. How do the bigger plants react, like the big one over there? Which one? Like this, this, that one. Is this a oh, plant? I don't know. Let's give it a go. Give it a go. Yeah, that one, yeah. Oh, the wee ones. <laughs> right, okay. <clears throat> right, well, let's just keep to the same way of measuring just for the moment. Now, I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll just measure across the leaf. That'll do. Let's just see what happens. Uh. Oh, that was me. <laughs> Okie cokey. Have we got any signal? Oh, we have. Yeah, it's going like to like three, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. The Disney film, it might be that. But she's just it, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> So what I hear whenever I'm listening to that is that there's three things. There's that pulsing low note, and then there's obviously that, that high, really high one that comes in occasionally. And then what's interesting is that da 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 Yeah. It doesn't do many notes. It does three or four and just so it doesn't doesn't go all the way up and all the way down like that one when it was playing the piano that yeah. sort of went from the lowest note on the piano to the yeah. highest note and down again. It's just doing a few notes next to each other. And I 
at the same time as that low pulsing and the, and the same time that high thing. Mm. So it's it's very different, really. Yeah. And it's consistent like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, the other one was like all over. Yeah. It was like the so piano was not big enough. Then. I need more than eighty-eight yeah. notes. Yeah. 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 Come on. <laughs> so is the plan like just speaking as a whole? Because I was just thinking like this one was all over the place, but it's got lots and lots of different little leaves. Whereas that one's a bit more well, still a lot, but more kind of. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Oh, yeah. This out. this yeah. is more like a gentle giant, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. It's like, yeah. Cool down. This is like the big Brabowski, you know, it's like, hey. <laughs> 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 yeah. 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 Yeah, and then she started screaming. And then she started screaming. We were like, "Well, I'm just on the edge." Um, I'm not. I'm not exactly sure how the electronics work in this, but but I think it takes a while for the machine to. Well, it doesn't tune in to it, but it maybe it keeps amplifying the signal until it gets something and it knows where. It, there's a sort of a dialogue. So sometimes you can plug it in and nothing happens. But after about five or ten seconds, something yeah, happens. Yeah. There's actually, um, I mean, when I got these made for me quite some time ago, 12 years ago, um, there wasn't a lot of this going on. And now there's a couple of machines that you can get now. That, but they're very small. They're very computer. They're, they're, they're small and they make a sound. What I like about this is that I've got a lot of control. Right. Um, but there, I noticed that whenever they turn the machines on, it's exactly the same thing. You wait for about five or ten seconds before. Same stuff, yeah. people touching plants and, you know, exactly the same stuff. It's just like you're waiting for the currents to travel from there yeah. to yeah. there, maybe. It's just a bit of a delay. So we are going to try on this, weren't we? So let me just, try, let me just take this off a minute. So that's it off. Let me just. Uh, which one are we going to? This yeah. one. Oh, it's quite crispy. <laughs> I mean, you could go at this bit here because it's kind of yellowing, but it might still. I don't know. Yeah, well, I can get, I can reach this one, so I'll I'll stick to here. That's there. That's just me. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Well, we can recognise some of what it was, but it's obviously, it's got the components, but in a different yeah. way, yeah. isn't it? Mm. That's interesting. There's nothing really coming through here. When we move it back to
it is quite relaxing, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. it is. Yeah. Let's try this fella. Mm. Uh. Right. Um. <sighs> so what we'll do is that we'll... Same thing, one across a leaf. It does sort of matter, I've noticed, it does matter where you put put the connection. Um, because I'm going to put the, I'm going to put this other bit of wiring into the, into the soil and some leaves will work better than others because there's a better connection. Right, let's just see if we've got any signal out of interest. Out of interest. So, are plants of the same type, are they more likely to make the same kind of noises or not? Yeah, I have noticed that um, um, a lot of it's got to do with the leaves. And I think I'm noticing that because that's my way of connecting with the plant. And I think that bigger leaves, more moist leaves, are um, um, have got more capability of transmitting electricity, right. or for me to pick yeah. it up. Yeah. There are things that I could do to to narrow stuff down. So for example, I could um, uh, put some conductivity fluid onto the plant and, and, and try to make everything exactly the same. I'm not doing that because I'm not really that interested in being that scientific. It's just interesting to see what sort of music I can get out of the plant. And for me, the, the fact that, it's, that, that it is what it is is sort of interesting enough. Rather than so, I'm not necessarily trying to understand the plant. I'm interested in, I'm, I'm, I'm trying. I'm just interested in what it gives me as a whole. You know, like for example, I'm interested to know as whether you come across as friendly. I'm not interested that much in getting to know you really well to see if you really are evil underneath everything. Or whatever. Yeah. It's, you know, it's the same with the plant. You know, a plant, a plant might be, um, a plant might be like going. I'm not, I'm not giving you much information. And that's interesting enough for me. Yeah. We found that with, with, with the plant over there where it wasn't given as much information until we touched it. And then yeah. it got, and then it said, that enough is enough. Yeah, it got angry. <laughs> yeah, that one. Yeah, that one. You know, so, so that, that was interesting. Let's just see whether we get. <laughs> right, this is very different. Yeah, I can smell chips. How's that happening on my plant? <laughs> <laughs> so I wonder whether it's more
I think you can read a lot into this, can't you? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, they, I think they, <laughs> they, they do and they don't. Yeah, I mean, they have, they have a character anyway. Yeah. Plus, I mean, in the sense that they do sound different. I mean, yeah. They are doing different. They've all got their own like material. Yeah, because they all behave and differently. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because, yeah, because, like, all plants, it's, 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 the growing plants and the certain plants, is they all have different needs. I'm sorry. So <laughs> it's her idea, not the mine. Soil, sunlight, water, how you water them, like, what materials it's near, or, yeah. like, some plants like that, they'll just be near constantly, and yet mm. they'll be. And they're all, in some ways, some of them fulfilling a different function, yeah. aren't they? For so the feet of the animals, bees or whatever, yeah. they've all got the same. Yeah. I'm really fascinated with the passion flowers this year. Like that they literally come for one day and it's yeah. beautiful, and the next day it's all closed by one again. Yeah. And yeah. it's just a, a lot, isn't it? Yeah. I've, I've got quite a lot of orchids in my house. Mm. And I place them where I want them to be. Uh-huh. Yeah. So, Oh, I might not. I can't even remember what we did before, but let's just... Yeah, it's a while, is it? Yeah. Let's listen to this plant first of all. I've just plugged it into this grey box because time's moving on and I'd quite like you to hear the grey box. And what what the grey box does is that... Well, what, what they both do is that is that it does a simple thing is that it takes a measurement so so this is this is measuring the plant yeah but the it's 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 happening in real time so when you measure it depends affects 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 what you see yeah so if if, if this is looking at it at the plant every second or something like that it's telling you what it see, sees every second this allows us to do it in real time, so it doesn't sort of measure it, it just gives you all the information. So it's it's quite sensitive. So let's just, and, and for that reason, it sounds completely and utterly different. So let's just, yeah, we've got, we have, we have um, stuff going on here. Right, okay. So, the 
So that's the fire electrical signal coming from the plant. Was that me or? Yeah, I think so. Or rather, well, rather, was that the plant or something going fast? Oh, I think that, that was no, the plant. That was the I plant. Think. So this this is taking two types of measurement. This one is the the, the fluctuations of electricity happening from the. from the root to the to here right <laughs> yeah, I think it's me isn't it and then this one is measuring the um the galvanic leaf response between these two sections time ago I worked with a with, with an elderly woman who was a pioneer of electronic music in this country a woman called Daphne Oren and um, and she was convinced that um, metal baths you know the baths used to be made of metal mm -hmm. she was convinced that they were really important because they allowed you to earth yourself yeah. you know that you would go and you'd sit in the bath water the taps are connected or the pipes are connected and you go and you earth oh, and flatten your electric charge basically and that was sort of one of the points of, of the bath as well as getting clean you know um, and it's interesting as well that that's what a bath does and when you come out of the bath you're quite relaxed yeah yeah the my uh, my wife's mother used to say a bath would weaken you. You know, you, you go in and you come out and you yeah, go like, you know, whatever. Yeah, yeah. Whereas the way a shower works is that um, the shower's got uh, the, the, the shower head and you've got those tiny little holes and, and the, the water's pressurized through those holes and it's just, and obviously, um, obviously, uh, the H2O molecules are are so small that, that the holes are quite big for them. But the, the H2O molecules are in groups and clumps. And it's a bit like watching a whole lot of people go through a stadium gate. So what happens is that when they go through the gate, they all go through like that. But when they go through the gate, they don't stay like that, do they? No. They, yeah. they, they go yeah. out. Yeah. Yeah. And that's what happens to the molecules. and and they, they, they go out and they spread and as they do there's 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 loose ions I O N S and there's electrical charge in those ions. And when you have a shower you you come out invigorated, don't you? Because yeah. you've been charged. So a shower is different yeah. from a from a yeah. bath. Yeah? yeah. Um and we can carry different amounts of electricity. It's quite possibly in the early in the morning and stuff, you know, you had more yeah. charge and the more times you've touched things, the more you've discharged. Yeah. yeah, that's true. You know, so we're not the same all the time. So, so yes, you are the same person, but no, you're not the same person. <laughs> How weird is that? Yeah. Very weird. <laughs> okay. Is that your phone? Then? 
Oh, yeah, yeah that's right. Yeah. 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 yeah, you're the back. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's off now, is it? It's off, yeah. Okay, so let's just see what happens. We're, we're going to feed into an oscillator, as we did before, into a sine wave thing. <laughs> Very sensitive. So what I'm going to do is change that to something like that. Oh, hang on a second. <laughs> that happened at exactly the same time I pressed go. Well, that's weird. I've never heard anything sound like that before. Let's just try it the other way around. Right. So if you come over here, because you haven't seen this, you can see the actual waves that the plants are actually producing. So I'll just do this again. So this is this one here is between the root and the leaf, and this is the one just just at the top of the plant for what it's for what it's worth. Right. Wait a second. <laughs> We've heard that one. What I wanted was, I think it was this one. see the, the signals are actually quite different as well on the different areas of the plant. Now I've had to oh, see. I'm getting, I'm getting a lot from this plant. It's an incredible plant, isn't it? Just do your thing.